Welcome to howtoconnectbooking.com to Uplisting. This is an updated guide as of October 2023. It involves a couple of steps, but nothing too strenuous. It should be set up in a couple of minutes. To start, you need to log in to your booking.com extranet account. Then click on the account icon in the top right hand corner. Look for connectivity provider. You can read the details on this page, but what we want to do is search for Uplisting here. By default, all options that we manage on Uplisting are checked off, so we can leave those options as they are, then click Connect. The connection request is completed on Booking.com's side. However, we now need to approve this connection on Uplisting's side as well. It's usually an immediate action. On Uplisting's side, click on the property you want to connect. This will display the property settings. Go to Booking Sites and connect booking.com. What we need here is to enter the property ID, which you can find on your booking.com extranet. We'll just copy and paste this on the calendar, then click Next. Since we already confirmed the connection on Uplisting side, which is usually an immediate process, we can then click Next and Match Listings. At this point, you may see an envelope icon which tells you to wait, which for this example has just disappeared. This means that Uplisting is yet to confirm the connection that you have requested. We try to do this immediately, however if you refresh your page it should allow you to proceed to the next step, and if not, please wait a couple of minutes then refresh your page again. Here we can click on the drop down, where we will see our property. If you have multiple properties on your calendar on booking.com, like we'll show you here, you will notice that there's another ID, which they call Room ID, like this one. It's usually a property ID ending in 01, 02, 03, etc, depending on how many properties you have under that property ID. On Uplisting, choose the Room ID that you want. We only have one in this example, so this is the only one that is showing here. If you have more than one listing, Uplisting will prompt you to confirm the next listing, which will go to concurrent listings to complete the connections. If you don't wish to connect all your rooms to Uplisting, that's okay. You have to do it first initially, and then you can remove the connections afterwards. Since we only have one room to match, we'll just select that, then complete connection. Once you click this button, Uplisting will do a refresh of your booking.com calendar and will sync rates and availability instantly. If you see the screen stating listing connected, it means that the connection is completed on Uplisting side and on booking.com side. You can now go back to your calendar. You may see that this is currently blocked in red, however if we refresh, it should change to green and turn to a bookable state. By default, Uplisting syncs to the standard rate so you can compare what rate we are syncing. In this example, we have $115 daily rate, and that is also what is showing on Booking.com's calendar as well. As a reminder, if your calendar has multiple red blockers showing, just give it a few minutes, refresh your page, and then it should automatically become open and bookable and turn to green. Should you have any queries, feel free to reach out to our support team on the live chat or at support at uplisting.io. Thank you.